Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and we're just moments away from kickoff time. Stay tuned for the live action. And good evening to you from the Parc des Princes here in the French capital, Paris, the venue for tonight's action. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And on the menu today is live action from Liga. It's Paris Saint-Germain, and they take on Strasbourg. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, giving the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's how the lineup looks for PSG. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Ashraf Hakimi plays with Nuno Mensch in the fullback positions. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And so the initial 11 for Strasbourg. Well, in this 4 5 1 shape, it will be interesting to see how close the wide midfield players get to their main striker. Will they stay wide or play through the inside right and inside left positions? We'll have to wait to see how it develops. And the contest begins. Delivery and cleared away. Dylan Bakwa. Oh, good looking run. Has a go. Oh, good save. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Able to skip past his man. And the spotlight certainly on Usman Dembele, who can change any game with one kick of the ball. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, he's such a creative player, both with his passing and his ability to beat defenders. He'll have a big influence today. Could be! Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Taken short. Spot on with that tackle. Not putting so much effort into winning back possession.
Omega. Diara. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. And let's give credit to the defending. And passing it well. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Well, it really wasn't easy for the keeper to stop it. Brilliant save from that sort of range. He had no right to stop that. So the corner played into the box. Splendid defending. It's a perfect challenge. Can he put them in front? He'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Diara. Well, PSG doing well to regain control of the ball. Sila. So. Ismael Ducouré. It is Sila. Diara. Moving into the advanced position. Over the touchline for a throw in. Oh, that's splendid play. And very nicely positioned to win it back. Dembele. And quick thinking defensively. To take the lead. Oh, a sensational save. Well, what a piece of goalkeeping that was. He's moved so quickly to make that save. Absolutely brilliant. And over it comes. And dealt with it nicely. Diara. What was the chance they could get caught out on the break here? Pulls it back. Terrific piece of anticipation. Good run, very much in control of the situation. Asensio. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And that is that for the first half here in the French capital. Well, normally one who dazzles, Ousmane Dembele, but less so today, Stuart. Well, as the touch match shows us, he hasn't posed much of a threat so far, and that's down to a couple of things. Yes, the service hasn't been great, but his movement hasn't been good enough today. So here we go, the stars of the second half at the home of PSG, the Pac de France. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. It should be! Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Now, what can they do from here? Offside the decision. Good tackle. He has teammates around him. Ducouré. Well, no stopping him. 
Made it a bit too easy for his opponent. Well, no way through. Zaire Emery. That's a good pass. And it could be for Marco Asensio. Now, what can Paris Saint-Germain do from this position? Dembele. Could take the lead. And the keeper more than equal to it. Playing it in. Not away completely. Thirty minutes to go then. Vitor Ferreira. Moving the ball more than decently, but can they take the lead? Might be a chance here. And a goal! That will do it! They've been pushing for it, and now they've been rewarded. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, he knows that could prove to be a massive goal. Just look at his reaction. Now back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. A very timely interception. and execution well even marginally offside is still against the law yeah and he just needs to hold his run for a fraction longer and he would have been in on goal Hakimi And defensive play to be applauded. And there's the feed into the box. Well, full marks to him for that header, but the goalkeeper did his job. And a corner for Paris Saint-Germain. What can they do with it? Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. And over it comes. Now the keeper grabs it. Sila. This looks interesting. A deft clearance. Oh, great attacking play. Decisive in the tackle and a throw in here. Koro Muani. Plenty of support here. Fabian. Feeding it through. Well, he's been ruled to have taken up an illegal position only just, however, Stuart. Well, he loves running off the back of defenders, but on this occasion, he's just gone a fraction too early.
just 10 minutes to go and quick thinking defensively it is Sila Well, it's not quite in the history books just yet, but PSG on the cusp of recording a victory. Stuart, how would you critique their performance of this one? Well, it's been a tight game, but I think they've been the better team. They've just had that little bit more quality, certainly in attack, and of course they've been well organised at the back. They just need to see this through now. Can he finish this? Really had to make that save to give them a chance. Well, great save, but now they have to create a chance of their own. Not long left now. He's driven in the corner. Sound piece of defending. And possibilities here. Delane. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Looked like an effective counter-attack. And that will be all. Three points for PSG. That's the good news for their fans around the world. Your assessments? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.